what's going on youtube um and today's video is just basically gonna be about um booking a load through uber freight and we're gonna see how much money you will make on this load all right so stay tuned it's gonna be a two thousand dollar payday in a day and a half let's get to it Okay, so I just booked a load right now from Paw Paw, Michigan to Cle Cleveland, Tennessee. So right now I'm going to show you how you guys can navigate through the app and whatever. And basically how you can book your own load and stuff. And it's a great, it's a great app. I love the, the that broker. I have a couple and I'll leave um the names of them on the description so I'll like if anyone had heard of coyote or drive expo convoy that's how basically uber freight operates but i just feel like they have everything a little bit more smoother and they're less annoying they're not constantly tracking you or saying hey if your app is not open you're gonna get a fine so uber freight is pretty like chill and and their app is is easy to work with like a caveman can even do it all right so yeah we're gonna get into that and i'm sorry for rumbling right now yeah so like what i was mentioning coyote go drive expo we even have combo right here but let's go into uber freight all right so right here you can book your loads you can see what's what's the current market how much they're giving you um, your rate. So this one's like $4.08 per mile. They even have, it's all, they have all the descriptions, like even the weight, everything you could bid as well, but not, you can't bid on every load. It's the one that says bidding available only. They even have ones that have multiple stops. So yeah, Uber Freight is easy to um, work around. And right here, you can customize how you want to pick up, whether it's near you or a specific place you want to start at. And then you can deliver the same thing. You can put the location for the delivery where you want to look for a load and end your load at. And that would work perfectly as well. Like when you're looking for loads, say you need to go to a certain state to maybe like return a certain part for your truck or you need to go home or run some airings or just want to visit another place um but yeah that's basically about it but now we're gonna go into the load that i'm currently on and that i booked and it's Paw Paw, michigan and right now as you see um we're gonna get paid $1,988, and we're going to Cleveland, Tennessee, and we got to be there around a, uh, on the 11th, around 2800 so this one doesn't have the weight, sometimes they'll have that, but it's all right, because once um, we get loaded and we get our paperwork, we can see all that information. So yeah, as I just got done showing you guys how to maneuver around the app and whatever we're just gonna wait right now since we are right here um at the shipper we're just gonna wait till we get loaded to see what we're working with how much uh this load weighs and see if we need to uh get away and whatever and get some scale tickets and then we'll be on our way so mission is to well we're on the road to two thousand dollars in one single day one day and a half, right? So, yeah, once we get loaded, we're, we're gonna, yeah, so once we get loaded, we're gonna get head out. Yeah, once we get loaded, we're gonna head out and uh, go. All right, cool, so right now we just got done being loaded and uh, we're gonna get this bad boy waves because it was around 3,600, thousand pounds so uh yeah we're gonna get to that right now and i'm sorry about the noise because i totally forgot to grab my camera and record this part but yeah um we're gonna go to pilot right now
or whatever the, the, the nearest scale. All right, so we just got here to pilot. We're gonna see how much this shit weighs. Total gross. So we're right over here. And I'm kind of hungry. I'm about to go get some Wendy's or something. Who knows? sun's coming down so i'm probably gonna end in the day and just drive the whole nine hours tomorrow because there's no point in just killing myself freaking doing all those hours so fast forward i went and grabbed some wendy's and knocked out for like a couple hours now i'm up um just reading a little bit and stuff um getting some water in my system and now i'm gonna go back to sleep and just wait to the time so our clock resets and we can start heading out on the road so yeah stay tuned i'm tired hey guys so we are just waking up right now it's roughly around like one in the morning right now uh, and i'm just gonna head out and shower first maybe get a coffee you know we're gonna check the truck out as well and then get on the road That's my alarm going off right now. It's we're one hour behind. Cause in Texas it's 12 o'clock right now. Alright guys, well I just got done showering. I feel 120 times way better right now. Uh, who doesn't love a good shower? But right now we're just gonna check the truck do our normal checks check our level and our fluids and um sorry that the lighting is shit right now but yeah we're gonna get to that right now okay so we got this nifty flashlight right now we're gonna close this open this right here a little bit difficult with one hand hold up Shit. There we go. And then the other hinge right here. Oh shit, you scared the fuck out of me. What's up? Huh? Me and my sister are probably out of days. She broke right here. And we're trying to get the mouse mission. If you can help us out with any kind of change, it would be great. I don't got nothing, man. No. Nah. I didn't mean to scare you. Nah, you I'm 
Sounds right good. Put this right here. Now I'm gonna put my flashers to check my lights. Make sure all my lights and blinkers are working. I'm gonna throw this hood down. Okay, it's working. The tires are good. Make sure it's good. Lights working. The tires good. The tires good over there. Lights good. Awesome. So we basically arrive here, but they've been taking for like two hours. It's taking forever. Right now it's roughly like about every 10 o'clock. Yeah, it's about to be 10 o'clock. It's like over two hours right now. I forgot to film once I had had arrived here because they had like three different locations for one address. I guess their plan's really that big. So just right now, I'm going through it right now. I had just checked up on them as well. Uh, that's one thing you guys need to do when you guys are waiting at uh, at the consignor shipper. Just walk in the office and see if they're, you know, doing something. Sometimes they might be done or whatever. Sometimes that's not the case, but um, in this case, they're still sorting out things. That's why there's like five other trucks with me and stuff. So it's like, ah, uh, whatever, fuck. So yeah, we're just gonna wait this one out. We're gonna nap a little bit and um, we're gonna see how this goes. All right, so right now we're just stopping at this truck stop to get some fuel and some snacks. I'm hungry as hell. I'm always hungry. Oh my god, I gotta change the shirt too. It got dirty in like a day. Because I was getting under the trailer and whatever. But yeah, we're just gonna head to the store right now and grab something and then pay for this fuel.
right. So we just paid for our fuel. I'm gonna go grab the gloves. You fuel up right now. Okay, so we're filling it up. We're gonna we're gonna pump like around. I'll say like 150 gallons. Look at all this mess right here. So yeah, you just get to see right here. <sighs> yep, fuel costs cost a lot, but you know, granted, we just made two thousand dollars just like that. Um, I mean, you're gonna deduct the fuel that you wasted. So basically, I only wasted maybe around like four hundred dollars. But yeah, that's basically it. That's I basically wanted to show you guys how you can make two thousand dollars using the Uber Freight app. How I made two thousand dollars in a day and a half. And um, yeah, and just a quick update. I did want to say like last night, um, the delivery spot did um, hold me up for like four to five hours. So that was excruciating. But you know, we're just attacking the day and uh, drive safe and like subscribe and put the notification on the bell to see my next video peace